This is just going to be a short video. Uh, we're just going to go through one box. I was sorting through some stuff in our warehouse area and I came across this box. And it looks like the type of box that we throw smalls into. But I have no idea where it came from. I don't know what locker. I don't know how long it's been sitting there. And so we're just going to go through it and look at what's here and look at what is there for value. So I'm going to set up my tripod and then we'll sort through it. All right, we'll start now. We got a couple of CDs here. Reba. Those are both in there. Got some pearls here. And I don't know. Usually you're able to tell just by looking at them whether or not they're real pearls. If they are, I think these are what's called is it South Sea Pearls? I think they might be just because how heavy they are and how irregular they are shaped. Having a hard time telling. Tennessee Mountain Bike Adventures, a collection of trails from Memphis to the Great Smoky Mountains. Hmm. That could be an interesting book. We've got an old lid for a ball canning jar. Broadway, what's this say? Germany. Hmm. Oh my goodness. Got a whole bunch of keys here. The Land of Oz. It's, uh, this is, says December 25th, 1945. So I guess it was given as a. Here it published July 1904. Hmm. That's pretty neat. General Biblical Introduction, H.S. Miller. Got a game of Rook. It's pretty nice. And we've got some more CDs. Honeymoon in Vegas. Hmm. That one's new in the wrapping. We've got repeating roll caps. All right. Oh, that's fantastic. Man, 29 cents. Wonder how old those are. What is this? <gasps> Empty. Bummer. Alright, what's this one? The Pastor's Ideal Funeral Manual. Hmm. Judging Dairy Cattle. You know, I vaguely remember seeing some of this stuff before, but for the life of me, I have no idea where it came from. I've got a little tin here. Tools and material. Something and J... I don't know. Don't know how to pronounce that. Got a watch. Got the letter R mounted on something. Hmm. Got a dog. That's quite heavy. Wonder what that was for. What's this? Bed bug killer. A thousand dollar guarantee. Price on this is 35 cents. I don't know what the active ingredient is. 
Wow, copyright 1938. Hmm. Got a knife here. Looks like a maybe an old imperial. Here is a box of 22 shorts, but it sounds like it's empty. It's got stamps in it. A bunch of five cent stamps. It's interesting. Oh, there's one on the top. We got an old pill bottle here. And a single button. Castle Heights Military Academy, 1902. It's kind of neat. All right, that was a pretty good load of stuff. So out of that box, this is what I priced to go in our store right away. Over 70 bucks worth of stuff here for our store. That's pretty good out of one little box.